45. Jeremiah chapter 50 and verse 45. Mm -hmm. Therefore, hear ye the counsel of the Lord. Hear ye the counsel of the Lord. Read. That he hath taken against Babylon. He hath taken against who? Babylon. That's the United States of America. Come on. And his purposes. Uh -huh. That he hath purposed against the land of the Chaldeans. Read. Surely the least of the flock shall draw them out. What's another word for least? Little. Little. Bring it another up. word for least is little. What is the flock talking about? The European nations. Right. And out of all of the European nations... Amalek going into the land in 1948 would make them the newest. That's right. Nope. You understand? That would make them the newest, the little, the least. Read. Surely the least of the flock shall draw them out. Uh-huh. Surely he shall make their habitation desolate with them. Go back to where we was at. Where was we at just before this? Ezekiel. Ezekiel. Go back to Ezekiel 35 and 12. Ezekiel chapter 35 verse 12. Uh-huh. And thou shalt know that I am the Lord. Uh-huh. And that I have heard all thy blasphemies, which thou hast spoken against the mountains of Israel. Read. Saying, they are laid desolate. They are given us to consume. Right. They said, hey, it's laid desolate. It's, we, it belongs to us. No. God never gave you that land, you bastards. That's right. Revelations 2.9. Because now we realize that they're the least, they're the little ones, right? They're not great, like that great city, like that great uh, dragon. They're the least. Revelation 2.9. Because in the land, they would speak great blasphemies, right? They speak blasphemies. Watch what they're called in Revelation 2.9. Revelation chapter 2 and verse 9. Come on. I know thy works and tribulation uh -huh. and poverty. So God, Christ is talking to us, the real Israelites. He says he knows what we've gone through and what we're going through. Read. But thou art rich, uh -huh. and I know the blasphemy. And the blasphemy, we just read that in Ezekiel 35 and 12. Who did it come from? It came from America and Amalek. You understand? The blasphemy came from America and Amalek. Read that part again. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews. They say they're the people of God. Read. And are not. And are not. But are what? But. Or the synagogue of Satan. Synagogue of what? Of Satan. Little Satan. That's right. You see that? Bring it uh, up. You see, that's in the scriptures right there. Now, learn today. go back to Isaiah 14 and 12. We almost done. Watch this. Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12. Listen up. Watch this. Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12. Come on. How art thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, uh -huh. son of the morning? Son of the what? Son of the morning. Hey, what gives light? In the morning, the sun, right? And is, is it dull or is it extremely bright? Right. Meaning, well, if something's bright, you can have the illusion that it's good, mm -hmm. right? right? Hey, do me a favor for the sake of time. Give me the last video. Give me the last video. Watch this. Pay attention. Our war against Hamas is a test for all of humanity. It is a struggle between the axis of evil of Iran, Hezbollah, and Hamas and the axis of freedom and progress. We are the people of the light. We are the people of the Stop! Stop! Run it back! What did he just say? Play it. The axis of evil of Iran, Hezbollah, and Hamas, and the axis of freedom and progress. We are the people of the light. They are the people of darkness. Not according to the Bible. You see that thing? That's right. They, they change it upside down. Uh, they change it, flip it upside down. But most are going to set that thing straight. Second Corinthians 4 and 4. Watch this. They say that they are the light. Okay, watch this. Second Corinthians chapter 11 and verse 14. Uh huh. And no marvel. For Satan himself, for what? Satan himself, for who? Satan himself Read. is transformed into an angel of light. Yes, Boom! 